two recommendations. Firstly, members note the extension of the contract with the RQS, and then secondly, that members note the progress in implementing the medium term asset allocation framework, the cost incurred to date, and approve the additional expenditure required whilst we undertake the tender exercise in relation to the provision of strategic asset allocation advice. Thank you, Chair. So, my understanding is we'll consider those recommendations after the presentation of the exam data. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, Peter. Uh, so, uh, agenda item 17 again, which is um, a regular item, which is uh, admission um, application. So at this point in tonight's um, uh, pensions uh, committee, I'd just like to uh, go to the exempt items. And so uh, under section 100A4 of the Local Government Act of 1972, the public can be excluded from the meeting during consideration of the following items of business on the grounds that they involve the likely disclosure of exempt information as defined by the relevant paragraphs of part one of schedule 12A as amended to that act. Uh, the public interest test has been applied and favours exclusion. So, do we have anyone who proposes that we go to exemption? So, sorry, did you approve the minutes as the last item? Because I didn't hear that. It, there's some exempt items in relation to that. So, okay. we're going to consider the approval of the minutes and the exempt. Okay, that's fine. Exemption. Anyone proposes that we're happy to do that? Okay. You're going to propose? That's seven. Yeah, so you I'll propose. I'll propose. Thank you. There you go. Sorry about that. I'm in the ropes, you know. 
Shall we thank you for that? Okay.